what's up badass hoes welcome back to my channel and in today's video i'm gonna be doing a, a what's in my tote bag what's in my wannabe mark jacobs tote bag i don't care what nobody say if it says the tote bag then it's a tote bag mark jacobs or not it don't matter like i'm still the baddest and i'll still take your man with this bag at the end of the day so don't come at me about my bag now i got this bag from amazon it was around like 37 dollars very affordable very cheap i will link it down below i have an amazon storefront so make sure y'all go check out my storefront and see what i've got up in there i got some goodies up in there so let's get straight into what's in my bag i'm not gonna lie it's very organized in this bag surprisingly it's not unorganized i usually be all over the place sometimes it's, it's not all over the place it's very 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 organized so first we have this pink fluffy pouch that I got from Sheen. It looks very, very bulky because I got a lot of stuff in here. So let me show y'all what I got in here. So the first thing I got is this Bomb Deer Bright Cream. Y'all, this lotion smells so good. You gotta have lotion on you go because sometimes you go to looking ashy. You know I'm black or whatever. So ash really gonna show up on me. And we don't like that for me. We don't want nothing, no ash on the skin. We don't want to be looking ashy at all so you know say i gotta go to the club real quick i don't forgot to put lotion on i'm rushing out the house everybody rushing me i don't forgot the lotion i got lotion in my bag and it smells good it smells like vanilla ice cream it smells so good i love this lotion yeah this is the bomb dia bright cream lotion very moisturizing very good smelling i love it and just always have a mini size of lotion in your bag because you don't never know when you might need it and then i have the matching body mist the brazilian crush Cheriosa 40. I just like to call this number 40. Okay. This scent smells so good, y'all. Like it smells so so good. It smells like vanilla ice cream. It's literally the same scent as the lotion. It's it's the matching body spray. It smells super duper good. And you always want to have like a mini perfume in your bag. Don't matter if it's body mist perfume, whatever. Because you never know when you might need to add some more perfume. And smelling good is key to me. Like I gotta smell good because you can't look good and stink. It's not a good combo. So you got to smell good. I look good. I smell good. The baddest bitch walking. The baddest bitch in the whole entire room. Period. So yeah, I do carry this on me. I do have the mini. I do got to get the bigger size because I love this scent so much and I overspray everything. Now the big bottle probably not going to fit in my purse. I mean, it could fit in the purse, but it's just going to be too damn big. So it's always good to have a little mini when you ain't trying to carry your big perfume around. Okay. Okay. The next thing I have in my little mini pouch is this Rescue Remedy Spray. This is a natural stress relief spray. If y'all been watching me, y'all know I struggle with anxiety. Real, real bad anxiety, child. And if you got anxiety and if you suffer from panic attacks or whatever and you need a quick fix, I do recommend this. You just spray a couple sprays in your mouth and you should start to feel relaxed and a little bit calm or whatever. And I got to keep this on me for them panic attacks. Like, panic attacks are not fun. They're not cool to deal with. I'm not going to lie. I don't like it. That's probably the worst thing that I've ever encountered with is a panic attack. I don't like it because you start to feel ill. Your heart be beating at your chest. And that can happen when you're out in public and you don't need that, baby. You don't need that. So, I always make sure I carry me one of these, okay? One of these, child. So, yeah, you could get this at, like, Sprouts or like a health food store the brand is batch original flower remedies and the name is rescue remedy spray natural stress relief I had to put y'all on just in case y'all got anxiety because i know anxiety is common and sometimes you ain't got your meds or you're not on meds and you need a quick fix and this is a quick fix all right the next thing that i have in my little pouch is this extra long lasting gum i always have gum on me. this is the polar ice flavor i always have gum because one you could have just ate something and now your breath stank and now you need a mint. Or simply because I have acid reflux, I always have to burp or beat my chest and I get nauseous easily and I'm also scared of throwing up. I have a metaphobia, so gum has always been my go-to. It's low-key like my lifesaver when I don't have nothing else and I'm on my last leg and I don't feel good and I'm so sick. This is literally my go-to. Like, I swear, like, if there's nothing else I'm going to take, I'm going to take some gum and I'm going to chew some gum. Gum has a lot of benefits, um, like helping your nausea, helping acid reflux, helping anxiety. So you can like get your mind off anxiety and, you know, making your breath smell good. Because like I say, you go out, you eat, now your breath hot. You need some gum? You do. Okay. The next thing I have in my pouch is a pad because I'm a female. I'm not a man. Yeah. So, you know, once a month. A hoe gets a bleeding down there. Fat mar gets a bleeding down there. And you never know when you might need this. This is an emergency thing that you should always carry as a female. A tampon or a pad, whatever. 
always have your pen period it don't matter period no tampon but you gotta bring a tampon just in case okay okay the next thing i have is this hello kitty lip smacker lip gloss i always have lip gloss in my bag this is super cute i got this from amazon and this i like the color of this like it's not one of them plain lip glosses it's that type of lip gloss that that actually makes your lips look pink and that's what i like about this like i would have thought that this would just be a boring ass lip gloss it's actually a cute pretty pink lip gloss it's just you have to keep putting it on over and over and over again and that's something i don't mind but i mean what did you expect it's a little ass child lip gloss so you probably going to keep putting it on and last but not least i have my nyx butter gloss i always have me a nyx butter gloss a lot of people always ask me what type of lip gloss i wear this is the main lip gloss i wear nyx butter gloss and I have this in the shade Cream Brulee. That is my favorite shade. I always use that shade or Tiramisu. But yeah, I got Cream Brulee. Makes my lips pink and juicy and cute. And guess what? Your man want to kiss. I bet you he do. I bet you he do. Nah, let me stop. But yeah, this is what I have to make my lips look real juicy and pink. Like, that's why my lips is always looking juicy and kissable. And that's why everybody want to kiss me and they're not getting a kiss like i don't know why people think that they can get a kiss from me just because my lips are juicy no you cannot get a kiss i'm sorry either way you might have herpes for all i know and i'm not on that so all right now i have another pouch okay so this is a little pouch i have it's a cute little peach pouch i got this from sheen okay let's go and see what's in this pouch all right so the first thing that i have in this pouch is this little lip thick brush yes this is a lipstick brush hair is everywhere of course and you just open it up and boom you have a mirror and that's what i like about it because it's a mirror and i could like look at myself real quick okay boom is that a hair on my nose you see that's why you have to have a mirror oh look at all my flaws Ooh. so you could be out and you might have to go to the club like i said you might have to go to the club and boom you trying to check your face real quick your phone dead you can't look at your phone have you a little mirror and then on top of that you have a brush now your hair's so nappy and you out in the club and your hair nappy you got to have a brush so i got me a little brush now does this brush really work it does not work that well i'm not gonna lie to you it's very cheap it's very flimsy i mean what do you expect it's from sheen honestly this is really good for like decoration and if you don't want to use the brush i just recommend using the mirror because the brush it really don't work like it does not do its big one it barely gets the naps out if anything, it's just there for the aesthetically pleasingness. I'm going to keep it real with you. I ain't going to never lie to you, child. The next thing I have is some Nausea Calm tablets. They do not work for me. Like I said, y'all, I suffer from a really bad acid reflux. And I probably have an underlying issue like gastritis or something that's causing me to feel sick all the time. So I do try to keep me a little something just in case I get too sick or whatever. But um, these really don't work. But they're natural medicine. I feel like if I continue to take them, they probably might help me. But I did get these from Amazon. These are the Nausea Calm. And yeah, I keep a pack of these on me. And they're literally, as you can see, I've been using them. I've been using them. Now, the next thing I have is this stack of hair ties. Yes, y'all. So basically, it's a pink little stack hair ties you take it off the little thing like this boom and put it back on there boom but knowing me i'm gonna take the hair tie off and put it on my wrist okay so you always gotta have hair ties on you y'all no matter what the circumstances is i know school is coming back up i forgot about it because i done graduated 2022 but hey people get slick out the mouth and especially if you're a bad bitch hoes are gonna hate you have you a hair tie, tie your hair up just in case you have to slap a hoe or a hoe come talking to you crazy. You got to make that hoe, give that hoe a two-piece because people like to try you nowadays. Especially if you go out, you look good, you got ops. Have your hair, have, have you a hair tie, I'm telling you. Honestly, I would tell y'all to have a gun in y'all bag, but that's a different story. Okay, that's a different situation. <laughs> okay. Now, the next thing I have in my pouch is this Vaseline Lip Therapy. This is like the rose one, I think. Yeah. It says rosy lips. It's real cute. I like this. It keeps my lips moisturized. And yeah, I always got to have my lips juicy. Like I said, I keep my lips juicy. I keep them pink and juicy. And that is why everybody wants to kiss. Like I said, they're not getting one. Um, okay, next. I have more lip gloss. At this point, I just carry lip gloss just to carry it. This is the Kiss Pinky Kinky. That's the name of it. I've used a good amount of it. It's a cute pink sparkly lip gloss. I love me a sparkly pink lip gloss, but honestly, I'm running low on it, but I still got some to use, child. 
and then i have more lip gloss y'all i promise y'all this is the last lip gloss this is tiramisu by nyx this is the nyx butter gloss i love tiramisu a lot of people always ask me what color lip gloss am i wearing it's either tiramisu or cream brulee by nyx butter gloss so yeah this is how this thing looks or whatever y'all see me and then last but not least i have a perfume oil now like i said you could carry a little small body mist around or whatever but if you really want to smell good and strong a perfume oil or a body oil whatever they call this this is going to have you smelling good as hell i have the escapade candy lover body oil by mo by mo better fragrance oils i got this from amazon if you know the perfume candy love by scotta that is exactly what this is smells like that exact perfume or teas by victoria's secret tea sugar floor this is that that's exactly what this smells like um this is very very strong you could just put a little bit right here and you will smell it all day and you can put it on your chest on your neck it smells so good it smells like sweet strawberries and candy apples with whipped cream and chow it is strong so say like i said you left the house you forgot your fragrance you got your little perfume oil it's gonna get you by i'm telling you it is going to get you by it is so strong and good i love this perfume oil and i like the brand too like the brand right here mo better mo better they do good on like perfume dupes i literally just ordered like three more of the body oils or whatever the only thing i don't like about them is they shipping is five dollars and that is literally ghetto because why is it five dollars like don't do the most and then they only give us a little bit but it smells so good uh i just love it i 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 love it and i tell y'all a little bit goes a long way so you don't have to use a lot and that's coming from me the person that sprays they perfume like it's no tomorrow okay now we down to the nitty-gritty of what's in my bag so i got my wallet i always have my wallet y'all why would i not have my wallet um y'all already know what we keep in wallets license debit card money funds shit i might even just keep a pocket knife here and not sight now but um i got this louis vuitton wallet i've been having this wallet for years i swear like i need to get a new wallet because i've been having this wallet for too damn long it's starting to look dingy but you know you just open it whatever boom put your stuff in there or you could just you know put it right here as y'all can see i don't have anything in here or do i <laughs> i'm a sneaky little bitch the next thing i have is my headphones i've always been a wires type of girl i've never really been an airpods type of bitch um i still do kind of want to get some airpods but they always fall out and i just find it very annoying and i don't have time for that because i get aggravated and i'm gonna be like well damn i lost my airpod where is it where is it and i know i'm the type to lose stuff so i carry me some wires um they always get tangled, but they're very easy to untangle. It's not going to take that long. And they're only like $20. And yeah, I always have me some wires to tune out people. I don't have time to hear what you're talking about. I don't care what you're talking about. Or sometimes I just be going to the grocery store real quick, have my little headphones and listen to my music while I pick out what I need to pick out and go about my business. Like I said, got to tune people out, tune out the world. I hate going to the public and the public is there like, oh, I just can't stand people. That's why I have my headphones. <laughs> And the next thing I have is a Louis Vuitton head scarf, head wrap, or whatever to wrap my lace up. Okay, let me tell you something. Like I said, you can go out, people be hating, you can get dragged. And your lace that came off, what are you going to do now? You're going to put the wig on and it's still going to be lifted up unless it's a loose wig. Child, and guess what you need? A head scarf. So I always keep me a head scarf. Or it's just say your lace just start lifting out of nowhere. You're going to want to keep a little head scarf. These are really these really come in handy when you need it honestly i should carry a bonnet on me because what if your wig gets snatched and it's lifted you gotta put a bonnet on i don't know but yeah i got this little louis vuitton head wrap i've had this head wrap for like a couple of years now probably like four three years i love this head wrap it's beautiful and it's louis v louis v and the last thing the last thing I got is my keys. Yes, I'm hiding my key because y'all don't need to see what my key look like. What y'all trying to come in my house? But let me just go on to the details with the keychain. Okay, so we have this little stabbing thing. I don't really know if this really would stab somebody, but I got it for the purposes of that it is cute and because it could possibly 
you know, puncture somebody in the eyeball. Now, you know, I'm a female, so I gotta have these kind of things on me because you might get kidnapped, somebody might try to hurt you, whatever. And then I have this cute little lipstick keychain. I think this is so cute. I did look at it. It's so adorable. And then I have this little thing. Then I got this little hair tie thing or whatever you want to call this keychain handle that I could put on my hand if I don't feel like, you know, holding it like this. I can put it like this and boom. My keys is on me and I'm not going nowhere. Can't lose your keys if you got loose. You can't lose them because it's literally on your hand. Don't lose it. Okay. And that is all that I have, y'all. That's all I carry in my purse because, child, that's all I carry. And sometimes I'll carry me a little water bottle just in case the bitch get thirsty. But yeah, y'all, that is it for this video. That is all I carry in my bag. And honestly, another thing that I would carry in my bag, I'm not going to lie to you, is a knife or a blicky. And um, I've hung out with some people and it wasn't this bag, but it was my Juicy Couture bag. Matter of fact, I want to show y'all that bag. Quick little story. So, I was hanging out with this girl that begged me and my homegirl Link. Now she so-called has beef with me. I'm telling y'all, a lot of people in my city do not like me, claim they want to fight me. I always bring protection on me just because I'm a female. I don't do it because bitches don't like me. When I went out with the girl, I thought shit was cool, but... I had a knife in this bag. This is the bag I brought. I had a knife in this bag. And like I said, I bring it for safety. I bring it for my own protection. It's my first time hanging out with y'all. So I'm going to have a knife regardless. But they had, when, when me and the person I was hanging out with, when we ended up like, when she ended up having a problem with me, which was after we linked, like months after, and she tried to talk her little shit about me. She was like, oh, you scary? You have a knife. Ain't nobody scary because they have a knife. So basically y'all are saying I am scary because I have protection and I find that very weird. I advise everybody that's watching this video to have protection on them because you are a female. It doesn't matter. People are crazy nowadays. And especially as a female, you can get kidnapped, you can get raped, you could be, anything can happen to you. And just for your safety, you should have something that could protect you from all these crazy people around here. And I just, was always that type to have my head in the game and have my head on point like don't don't let nobody hurt you or kidnap you so that's why i always keep something on me but this is the bag that i had worn this bag has been through everything i love this bag i got it from um burlington but anyways y'all thank y'all so much for watching this video i love y'all so much make sure y'all like comment and subscribe and i'll see y'all in the next video and make sure y'all leave some um video suggestions down below. And like I said, if you don't subscribe, I'm going to beat up your mom. Thank you. Have a great day.